The baptism is that outward symbol of what's already taken place in a person's life when they believe in Jesus. Trusting in his death for their sins, so completely trusting it, you're entirely immersed in it, just as Jesus was dead to this world, we're dead to this world in him, but uh, coming up out of the water, uh, symbolic of the new life that we have in Christ Jesus, the second, not even the second, faster than that, that we believe when we first believed in Jesus as our Savior. So let's sing the first uh, verse of this chorus, and then we'll proceed. This is Nancy Van Essen, and uh, Nancy and her family have been coming to our church probably a year and a half now, because you guys first came through the Vacation Bible School that we had, and uh, so I'll give you the opportunity to go ahead and share your story of Jesus with us. Okay. I have a very strange story, I think, because I feel like I have believed since I was a child but did not realize until I experienced my first big miracle, which was the birth of my first child, and how special God is and what he can do for you. Since we've been through many, many changes, he has carried us through. I always felt his presence, even when we decided to come out west, just me and my two children. My third one was already out here. And uh, so there are several spots along the journey where he has interceded, uh, confirmed his presence and his love for me and my family. And I think the biggest one was when we went through Rogers Pass. I'd come from the flatlands. <laughs> so standing there looking up in those mountains and seeing that waterfall that was so high up, it just seemed to proclaimed his presence, and I felt like I was there on this seventh day, saying, yes, it is there. It's a miracle. It's done. So all the religious training I've had was, you know, you obey the Ten Commandments. You know, don't do anything bad. That's all. <laughs> but from that point on, I really latched on to the Bible. I started studying it. I come to the women's Bible study group. It's just amazing. 63 years and I know so little. <laughs> but I can feel it, I experience it, and every moment that I discover through the Bible studies is very special. I guess that's about it. Okay. <laughs> Nancy, have you placed your faith in Jesus Christ for the forgiveness of your sins and you're trusting in Him alone for eternal life? I most certainly do. And I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. and seated us with him in the heavenly realms in Christ Jesus, in order that in the coming ages he might show the incomparable riches of his grace expressed in his kindness to us in Christ Jesus. And as you certainly have experienced the kindness that he's given us in Christ Jesus and share that today. So that's a verse I wanted to share with you. Thank you. Now you can go. <laughs>